I'm teacher Vicky and I am your teacher in English. We are going to discuss the topic on identifying real or make-believe fact or non-fact images for week 1 and week 2 for quarter 1. So these are the things that you need to know. So in this lesson, we will identify the real or make-believe fact or non-fact images. So here are the guide questions. And these are the questions that you need to be answered at the end of our lesson. Okay? So number one, what are real or make-believe fact or non-fact images? Number two, how to distinguish real from make-believe fact from non-fact images and number three how to create our own short story about real or make-believe fact or non-fact images okay so i know that you will agree with me that everything we hear read touch and see are not all real or fact okay so some of them are make-believe or non-fact Okay, so now we move on to our lesson. Let's go to the next page. Okay, so are you familiar with these two photos? Okay, you are correct. Both images are taken from the 2018 Disney Pixar's movie Incredibles 2. Okay, so this is an animated fantasy film. Okay, so I have a question. Which of these images can be considered real? If your answer is the first one, okay, this, this picture, the first one, okay, so your answer is correct, okay. So number one can be considered as real because this is a picture of a normal family, okay. How about, um, which picture is a make-believe? If your answer is number two, your answer is correct, okay? So, because as you can see in number two, they are superheroes, okay? And superheroes are make-believe. So, because they are not real, okay? Okay, so for this part of the lesson, we are going to find out how well do you know this lesson before we move on to our discussion part. Okay, so you are going to answer whether this is real or make-believe. Are you ready? Okay, so let's move on to our discussion. Okay, so when do we say that an image is real? Okay, so the first one is it happens in real life. Okay, and the second one, it exists. The third one is it refers to everyday activities. So anything, everything that we can see, we can experience, okay, and we know that is true, that is real, okay. For example, I want you to look around your house, your room, and try to see what images can you see is real. Okay, so I guess you have your own example now, but first, let's see my own examples here. Okay, so the first one is, the boy can fly a kite. So that is real. Okay, how about number two? Mother cooks my favorite food. Okay, so that's another real images or sentence. Okay? Okay, so now let's move on to make-believe. Okay, so make-believe, the first one is, it will not happen. Okay, so it will not happen in real life. Okay, number two, it is not real. Okay, and number three, it is in your own imagination. 
Okay. So now I want you to think. Think, close your eyes, and based on your own imagination, I want you to think of an example of a make-believe. You can make an image in your own head, and you can make your own sentence. Okay, I know you can do it. Okay, I know you already got your own examples of make-believe. And now, let's read my own examples here. The first one is, Donald Duck is a real dog. So, that is make-believe. Another one, the dog can fly. Because... Yes, we can agree with this, that dogs cannot fly. And Donald Duck is just, mm, just a cartoon, okay? A character from a cartoon. So, these are all make-believe. Okay, so now we are going to discuss the fact and non-fact images. Okay, so let's describe fact. Okay, so we say fact because it exists, it is a reality, and it is something that happened and can be proven. Okay, so again, I want you to make your own facts. I want you to create your own facts based on the things that you know already happened, based on the things that you know which is true. Okay, I know you can do it. Okay, I know you already have your answers and good job for that, okay? Let's read our own examples here. Number one, bat sleeps upside down. Okay, so that is a fact. Pupils learned how to read and write. Okay, that is also a fact. Okay, so now let's move on to non-fact. Okay. So, how do we know whether the picture or the image or the sentence itself is a non-fact? The first one is, it does not exist. Second, it is not fact. And number three, it is false or fictional. Okay, so I know that you can make your own again. You can think of the images and another sentences. That, okay, that suits our topic, which is the non-fact, okay. I know you are ready. Okay, congratulations for another examples that you have written or that you have think of. Okay, so now let's read the samples, the examples of our non-fact. The first one is Beauty and the Beast is a True Story. Of course, that's not real. And number two, fish cried when some of them were caught. Okay, we all know that is not real and that is non-fact. Okay, so now I want you to get again your notebook, your paper, and let's try to answer these activities. You are going to write whether these images, okay, are real or make-believe. Are you ready? Let's start! All right, I want you to get your notebook again or your paper and let's try to find out whether you understood our lesson, okay? I know you did, okay? So, let's start. <laughs> 